So, if you had a choice of where a wall would be built, where would you build a wall? In between us, so I don't have to do any more of this crap. I love you! <laughs> Well, today is day two of the Carlisle Antique Mall clean out. I've got a giant box truck behind me. Andrew is going to be loading a lot of the furniture into the box truck today with help from Jesse and also Rob. Um, Mary is here as well, and I was thinking of asking her if she'll help me clean up and tidy up the shop and start getting things in order here. Hopefully that'll work out, but I'm not sure yet. It's already noon. They were here an hour ago. They might already have plans of their own. So I'm gonna head in and figure out what everybody's doing. They make that look easy, don't they? See what I mean about cordoning off the shop? Mm -hmm. It's gonna have to happen. So, if you had a choice of where a wall would be built, where would you build a wall? In between us, so I don't have to do any more of this crap. I love you! <laughs> The purpose of the wall is the fact that we have so much stuff in here, we're not going to be able to fit it all in the back room. Okay, well so, then, then what I would do is I would wall this right across here and have this as a back room. I was thinking do it here because that way it's an extension of the shipping. No. 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 I mean, in theory... Wall, right across here. Double doors on it so we can get big pieces of furniture in and out of there. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, here. Man, yeah, I knew sorry. you would say that. I mean, that's the most practical place for it Thank to go. You. But I was thinking, I was thinking, you're walking away you're while I was thinking. You're making it more difficult. <laughs> that's why I'm walking away. He hates, he hates when I say I was thinking. That's why I'm walking away. He hates when I say I was thinking because he knows, he just knows. <laughs> All right, so Mary and I are going to be working on this stuff today. So I don't even remember. I don't even remember if I filmed it, but I did uh, create all of these boxes back here to go to auction at one point, like e a year ago at least. Um, so we're going to be going through these boxes again and snapping photos for the auction house so they know what is yeah, no inside worries. the boxes. Yeah, the other thing too is... I'm gonna have to move those safes, and the less distance I gotta move them, the better. Well, I'm thinking we could actually make a wall that goes over, and then this way, and then all of that is in the back room. That's fine, as long as there's double doors on it. Double doors. Not a single door, a okay. double door. Well, Dad's gonna be the labor, so I already talked to him about it. So yeah, so if we just extend and L, that's, that's fine. Okay. But I wanna do it over here, because I don't want to have to move the safes. Okay. I mean, it'll only be a temporary wall because eventually maybe we'll get all this cleared out and we can actually have the whole shop open. Well, that's fine. Uh, but for now, I, I honestly, I think this would be a good, good area to do that. Okay. We have to have, because we have to have the exit for an emergency. Yeah. We have to have access to the bathrooms for customers. Yes. So walling this off is not an option. Okay. So, but if we did that little L shape like you just suggested, I think that would work beautifully as long as we have double doors because there's plenty of room in between the counter and that wall. Yes. Um, it'll, it'll be ac accessible for people that are like customers in wheelchairs and stuff like we'll that. We'll also need to make little cubbies for people to bring their stuff up and like store it. Which we could do right on this wall. That's what I'm thinking. Right across from Perfect. the register. Perfect. Teamwork. Okay. Brains. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I love giving her crap. I know you do, especially on camera. Um, okay, so I'm going to talk to Dad about building that wall then. He said it would probably only cost a couple thousand, which isn't terrible. Considering well, I think we spent 10000 in the Well, you back. figure the wall in the back was a thousand. Yeah. Was it a thousand? I thought it was ten grand. And no, I'm like, was, no, that was a thousand. What? Okay. 
A no, wall. It, was, it was it was like ten for everything that we had done. They they patched up the they took the door out, rehung the door. On on the in the hallway. Yeah. And then they did all the build in the back, and uh, they put the, the the cabinet and the countertop in. Okay. You know that was that was all that. Plus they did all those LED lights too. Yes. So. So this should at most. I'm cost, thinking like, maybe twenty five hundred in building materials because the wall size is probably going to be about the same as what we did in the back. Okay. The double doors are probably going to be the the most expensive piece out of the entire wall. All right. But double doors so we can get furniture in and out. Well, I'm going to get dad on this like a week ago. Okay. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, wonderful. Thank you for your inputs. Great. Super. We're on the same page. All right, we're going to go hit gas station, get, grab beverages, and then go load up again. Okay. All right. Maybe grab some footage while you're over there so I can insert Probably it. Not. <laughs> Rob, can I count on you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, so I told Mary as she's helping me go through this stuff, she is more than welcome to anything that I have in these boxes. Um, but we're like slowly going through them. By we, I mean Mary. Mary's going through them at the moment. I'm just filming. Stand in there. <laughs> I swear I do work. I'm just like half the time holding the camera. Um, she just pulled this guy out. This was great. We got that one at that um, massive thrift store in Ohio. Which we're going to have to visit again this year, I think. Like I said, I mean, the stuff in here is sellable. It's just, it do I want to spend my time on it? That's the thing. Stuff, I've got so it, much other stuff to list at the moment. Yeah, a lot of it just isn't going to be worth your time. Like, what is this? Don't we want to know? <laughs> Looks like a quilt. Oh, stuff is falling. I don't even know... Like this is one of those qu the quilts that I got from the from that auction, I think. Yeah, I mean it's just sitting over here. <laughs> Massive crack there. Okay, so we're going through the boxes and these just came up. <laughs> and I have such a hard time getting rid of crack stuff. Because I guess because I've metal detected for so long that I'll find stuff and I'm like, oh well, it's broken on this side, but it'll display nicely. Mm -hmm. And so when I look at these, I think the same thing. That's why I have so many rejects in my office <laughs> on display. I mean, this is a pretty bad crack. It is a pretty that bad one is. But look at the really faces. Bad. They're lion faces. <laughs> this one is, I mean, it's. The Blanco is. You can hide it better. I mean, but you're still not in my head, I'm like, Jocelyn, just throw them away. But I can't. I'm going to donate these. We'll put these in a good bowl box. Okay. All right. I'll feel better. We'll okay, those aren't the donate. <laughs> we don't have a donate box. We don't do have it. a donate box yet. <laughs> Mary just uncovered the hair that we found in 2020 during our COVID shutdown. <laughs> I'm like, do you remember that? Yes, it's yes. Like in its own remembers. coffin. <laughs> I know. It's weird, right? <laughs> it's weird. Imagine opening that box and not expecting to find hair in it. It was. I can't imagine. It just <gasps> did. <laughs> That's too funny. I still don't know what to do with this. We had talked about donating it, possibly, but I don't know if hair this old can be donated. Do you know what I mean? Let's do it. Yeah. I mean, people do buy it. They buy it, they collect it, they make stuff with it. And I wonder how long ago this was braided. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. That's nuts. And it's such a weird box to keep it in. <laughs> this is a bunch of Andrew stuff that I've... It looks very Andrew. It does, but I don't know where it came from. What is this one? This one is probably the same. It's boxed up or wrapped up. I can't up quite that up. You think? Oh, I bought these for him. I <laughs> need put them in a box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, spoons. There's some silver so plates and tokens. Here's an old pen. Oh yeah, that one's cool. I wonder if that's celluloid. Here's a pen set. Oh. That's fancy. That is super fancy. <laughs> yeah, this is Andrew's stuff, I can tell. <laughs> and a razor. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man antiques. We don't need that. 
these are kind of cool. Those are kind of cool. Andrew's been hiding all the good stuff. Yeah. Those are neat. Mm-hmm. I like those. Oh, they're marked. It even says something. Made in Mexico. Oh, cool. Mm-hmm. This. I don't know what that is. Companions who have answered the call of their country. Huh. And then he, I do remember him telling me about these trail cameras, and I was like, why did you buy trail cameras? <laughs> <laughs> it's man stuff. It's, yeah, but I specifically remember him telling me how excited he was about those trail cameras, so. All right, um, that's obviously an Andrew box. He specifically said, don't put any of my stuff in the auction pile. Okay. So we'll just shuffle that off to the side for him to go through, I guess. Mm -hmm. Well, I am going to take these over and put them on my shelf to be list. <laughs> Because they're kind of adorable. Mary just uncovered this in the boxes. It's like a liquor, a pourer. And it comes out of his big <laughs> Corby's. Is that a kind of liquor, do you think? Um, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> That's really fun. I have to stick that over here with my hair. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wear a piece. 57 varieties. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that might be worthwhile. Stick that over here. See, I'm making, I'm moving the pile. You're just moving the pile. Did you notice that? Wonderful. <laughs> We're making progress. Nothing will be here. It'll be everywhere else. <laughs> well, well, you know, we have our donate box over there. We've got our pile. We're doing pretty well. Yeah, this is, I can't, this is my stuff. I don't know how it ended up in this pile. Oh, this is your do you stuff. remember those cats? Yeah, I do. I can put those in my office now. Yeah, let's put them in the Let's take the cats out and get They're wonderful. That's mommy cat. Look at her. She's wonderful. So the kitties will live here. This looks kind of like maybe daddy kitty. I don't know. The kittens are really tiny. Yeah. That's the teenager kitty. Yeah. <laughs> and then I have bookends. Random bookends that I won't use. Filled with sand to support heavier books. Japan. Wonderful. <laughs> So this is all stuff that I had set aside to keep for myself. Those are the boxes we're into now. I don't know how they ended up over here. But this just came out of the box. This is a lamp. You can see it says Baccarat on there. Um, this is a lamp that Eric gave me. And I think this belongs in my office. Because I love this. I think that's a Kingfisher on there. Let's see, I'm going to set it on a card real quick. Because it does come up like this. Of a weird setup. I don't really get it. But I'm at one with it, so that's definitely going to make its way into my office. I think that one is broken. Oh, yeah, maybe it's not. Just, well, it's monogrammed, too. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Celluloid? <laughs> sold all of the salt and pepper shakers out of here that I was excited about and I think this is the leftovers. I mean there are sets in here and there's some like the shark. I mean salt and pepper shakers though are getting to be a harder thing to sell. They are. These are these still have salt in them. Okay. Yeah those can go to auction. Okay. I'm over them. I just gave Mary a creamer, and I just realized the sugar is also in here. There you go, and it is glowy glass. Yeah, it's all here. Here is the base. Thank you. And here is the lid. The lid. That's gonna be. Lit. So are you gonna be selling this on whatnot? Maybe so. Maybe so. You're gonna have to go check out Mary's whatnot. Merryweather Market. Merryweather Market. Yes. She has just started selling on one. How many sales have you had? One. One. <laughs> well, my you're getting lots of stuff. You're going to be ready to have this other one. I have my second and my third scheduled soon. All right. So. And one's jewelry, right? One's jewelry and one is scarves to get ready scarves. for fall. Scarves. Oh, I like it. Yeah. I like it. So I will link that down below for you guys. But do you see, see anything else in here that you could use? That's cute. 
Uh, like I said, there's good stuff in here. It's just, I only have so much time. All right. Oh, here's another cheeky guy. Maybe. How heavy is he? He's, um, Pretty heavy. like a pound. Yeah. Well, he would, he would go good in your store. You're probably right. <laughs> You should take him out and put him yeah, in your Okay, fine. Out. I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the whole point is to be getting rid of stuff. <laughs> I know, but you, now you're going to have a... <laughs> so we have to be moved out by tomorrow. Tomorrow's the 31st, yeah. yeah. And it's pouring down rain, and I'm not loading and unloading in the pouring rain. It would probably ruin our stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've got... The second load is in the truck mm -hmm. right now. The truck's full, so I just gotta wait for this to stop before I can start pulling it off the truck. Mm -hmm. Jesse's bringing up the last of it and filling that nook over there. So this way it's all up. Okay. And then I don't have to worry about it. And I cleared out the closet already. All right. So it's just gonna be a matter of, uh, it's just gonna be a matter of getting the stuff off the truck and then getting the next load into the truck. I'm sorry I'm listening to this conversation over here. <laughs> <laughs> We're good. It's just a little bit of stuff. It's It'll be fine. fine. <laughs> There's room for it. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> I had a feeling this was bad. <laughs> right. Is this whole stack? Is this stack all good to go? This is all good to go. That's all good to go. Okay. Cool. Restaurant where I think. Water, yeah. Homer Laughlin. It's cute. Mm hmm. Celery dish. Yeah. Oh, here's one of those things. This is Yadro. Those two are going to go on forever. I know. <laughs> I think those are all Avon. Yeah, all these little things can go. Just making your decisions for you. That can go. That's fine. This can go. <laughs> that was cute, but I was missing too many pieces. Yeah. Those are cute. One of those got broken when it was being rested. Oh. For an umbrella? help you with that. We've actually got two of them. I'm not using that. Look, it's so cute. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. <laughs> you got more holes with this Swiss cheese. Oh, there's just a little hole in there. It's a parasol. That's not an umbrella. <laughs> It'll be fine. It won't disintegrate oh, until you get there, I promise. Go away. Look, Andrew, look. Look at my beautiful parasol. <laughs> so you don't want an umbrella? I'm soaking wet. I look like I peed myself, so don't worry about <laughs> Oh, shoot. The rain is slowing down, though. It's not. You could always put a blanket over your head and run down the street. <laughs> Just make sure I get it on video. I don't know. This one has some kind of a cover on it. Yeah, it's like a shaker yeah but i think it's just for the smoke to come through that's weird and then this is for cleaning your cleaning them out i like this one it's like sherlock holmes it is it's very sure <laughs> yeah that works all you need is the hat <laughs> <laughs> over yeah i'm pretty sure that's a silver hallmark right there on that little collar mm -hmm. do you see it yep can I read it? Nope. I know it was hurting my eyes to focus on it, so I'm like, never mind. I'll take a picture of it and then blow the picture up. You're so smart. Of course, the camera won't focus, you little piece of junk. There we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Uh, yeah, still can't. Oh, yeah, there it is. marks. It's an anchor. It's silver. The anchor, lion. the lion, and the K. So that'll tell you how how much silver content 
and one is like an import or export mark. So that's a UK mark. Yep, that's what I figured. And then the K would be the maker, I think. I think that's how that works. Heck yeah. 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 Andrew, king of scrapping things. You should have known. <laughs> All right, so we'll hold on to those for a little while. No, I think I, it's definitely silver. I knew that was a hallmark. So I'm just going to set these aside and let him... I'm going to ask him for the third time and the last time, are you sure you want those to go away? And then I'm going to say, well, I noticed, and then I'm going to rub it in his face. <laughs> this is a beautiful Murano bowl. See the gold in there? Mary says, that looks like it's going to glow, so now of course I have to test it. There's more glowy glass in here. Here's, this is a cookie jar. We can just have everything break and then you won't have to worry <laughs> That's really pretty. If I take anything big, I might end up divorced. <laughs> <laughs> federal. That's nice. Yeah. The um, shield with the F is federal. Yeah. Taking a box full of glow. I guess I'll take all the glowy glass. <laughs> I just bragged to my husband that I wasn't taking much out. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm like, yes, I'll take all of your uranium glass. All the glowy glass. <laughs> now, this is something that we wrap. Oh, that's more of those little dishes. EAPG. There's two of them. Yeah. Oh, this is a cute little sweater. I wonder if Laurel would fit. <laughs> Look at me. Like, oh, Laurel might fit. That. That's adorable. That's super cute. All right, I gotta see if I can clean those. I forgot where I got that one. These are little candles. This was missing the lid. This is our EAPG. We've got another one right here. Yeah, that one of them it. was cracked or chipped. That's why I was like, if there's just one I of think them. It's this one. It looks like yeah, it's not really there. worth it. This actually has the lid. That's Avon, though. There it is. Avon. <laughs> Little piggies. Oh, there's more. Look what I found. There's more. Oh my god. This box is quickly filling up. It's going to be like, Swan what is between cute. the time we here and the time we left? Is she broken? Is that why she's in here? She's not broken, but I think she's missing her friend. She's supposed to be a kissy angel. Look at him. <laughs> Look at her face. All right, you can put him up here. This is my cute pile. Yeah. <laughs> Brush. There's a lid to something right here. To what? We may never know. Too thick oh, yeah. In right now. That's inverted strawberries. Yeah. Really vibrant. Andrew's gonna see this and he's gonna be like, I knew she wasn't telling her to get rid of stuff. <laughs> I'm like, oh look, these are in right now. Yeah. <laughs> She's pretty. Oh, so see. pretty. Satsuma. No geisha. Nope. Just jerk. That's really pretty. I think that came in a lot of stuff. And there was like figural animals. And I sold the figural animals. And I'm like, I don't need this vase because the animals were the cutest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the vase. Right. Here you go. This is a gift. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah? There was something wrong with it, right? Um, well, it's just the little sugar. Oh, there's a chip. Mm. I knew. I knew there had to be something wrong with it. So I'm going to test this and see if it glows. We're going to bring it over here into our box. Yeah, there's like a little itty bitty bit. Yeah, but it's not enough. Not enough to call it glowy glass. I think I am going to sell this though. I remember why it ended up in the box and the reason is because when I bought it, it had the most amazing figural um, glass lid. I think it was a dolphin or something. And it was broken, but I decided to buy it anyway. 
And um, I was like, you know what, without the lid, I'll just put it in a box. But I think I'm going to sell it because it has this beautiful quilted design. And it has the gold in there. So, yeah, I'll put it on my shelf. You should be taking notes right now on how to pack a truck. Wow. I think he gets some sort of prize. Wow. <laughs> you mean how not to pack a truck? How oh. not to ruin your furniture in the rain? Yeah. Oh yeah, those go with these teacups. Yeah. Oh, they're um, cream soup cups. Yeah. They're very pretty. I could probably list those. I've gotten more into listing China than I was whenever I filled this box. Look at that little that little butt right there. Mm -hmm. What do you think that is? I don't know. Oh, it's a pig. <laughs> it's a mommy pig. It's a mommy pig. Does Laurel need a hairbrush? No. <laughs> it's cute, but she yeah. doesn't have any hair. <laughs> <laughs> Might be a while. It's cute, but she's bald. <laughs> <laughs> Poor child. This one's signed by... Oh, those Sebastian miniatures are the bane of my existence. <laughs> That's a good thing to oh, play J-Lo if you want a J-Lo something <laughs> powder thing. Yeah, some of them sell well. I think it's the nursery rhyme ones and the Christmas ones, but any other ones are not going to move, is what I found. Yeah. I'll move to something. Is this at George Washington glass? The Avon? That's the no. QVC glass, actually. QVC. QVC. Apparently it was a candle. Oh, I thought was it was it? a really cute little canister. I bought it and a lot of my viewers told me, oh, that was a candle. Oh my gosh. Isn't that cute? That is cute. I like that some of this still has the Goodwill sticker. <laughs> I know, just because I got overwhelmed and I was like, you know what, I'll just pass it along rather than so spend too much time thinking about it. That was, I think, an auction extra or something. I wonder who they are. Fancy Random people. Women. Random women. Imagine if I wore my hair like this <laughs> nowadays. I think you need to style it this way. I mean, I kind of like Ringlets. it. Ringlets. I don't hate it. <laughs> She's been sitting over here for so long. Yeah, that one's worth listing. Mm -hmm. Look at how much they cared about it, that they like cut out the little things. This was a whole process to have company over and set the table. Oh, yeah. Get everything out of the china cabinet. Yeah. That's crazy. So not me, but I'm going to move this over to list it. Look it's how so totally mid century. <laughs> I think you just talked yourself into having it put in a box. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Along with my loving gift. <laughs> I'm so happy you're keeping that. <laughs> okay, you talked me into it. I'll keep that. That's right. Oh, goodness. There are... These are for um, candles, right? Mm-hmm. They start with a B. I'll never remember. But I know all those crystals down there hang off here. Yeah. That's just too much. Mm -hmm. And there's some silver overlay down there. Mm-hmm. I know the silver is really heavy on them. Mm -hmm. There's a ton. Oh, the, the bottom is all um, salt colors. Yep. With the spoons. Yeah. It's good stuff to send off. Yeah, I can also. Hi. So we have gone through all of these boxes, stacked them all here, but. I have a pile of existing boxes over by the door of auction stuff, so we're going to condense everything over here in the corner. And um, every time I walk in and out the door, I'm going to have to think about them and be like, you know what? It's time. I need to get those to auction. So mm -hmm. um, that's where they're going to go live for now. So Mary's currently wrapping up her treasures. I just love this stuff. That's going to be awesome. Mm -hmm. You should talk to Yvonne about maybe doing a glow sale. Ooh. Have you seen her glow sales where she does like the side-by-side -side with the glow box? Uh-uh. 
is really, really cool. She just did one with George recently. But she has a second camera set up with a like light box with a black light in it. Yeah. And she has them side by side when she's doing the sale. It's really neat. Oh, I don't know how she does it, but that's a good idea. Well, it's so I cool. thought I had room for that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Progress was made today. We cleared this whole area. We moved everything over by the door where it is its next stop is out the door and to auction. Uh, Mary had talked about possibly taking this off our hands. What, the sofa? Yeah, she's thinking of putting it in her booth. Okay. I told her I drive a really hard bargain and I would I would say 20 bucks for the couch. <coughs> I think we, what, paid 10 for it? We double our money It and was it's gone? 15 with the buyer's premium. 15 okay. with the buyer's premium, so um, I'm making five bucks on it. <laughs> yeah, it's, I mean, everything's swept out, cleared out. Um, I've got a truckload in the nook over there on the loading dock. Um, truck's loaded right now, but I got a padlock on the back of the truck. So I'll lock that up, leave that here overnight, and uh, just remind me to extend the time on the truck because I'm going to have to extend the time on the truck. Okay. So, um, but yeah. It's done. So we go home. I want to get a shower, and then I got to come back here and run the UPS packages. Okay, I'm gonna go have dinner with my parents and bring Ashton his basketball stuff. All right, so here it is in all its glory. I'm just gonna keep chipping away at it, and eventually, it's going to look like a shop. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you. This every day, and I'm still so amazed by you.